Each new model is assigned a grayish-blue appearance by default. The Appearance palette can be used to assign a new appearance to an entire model, surface, or components in an assembly. The Appearance Gallery contains a list of user-defined appearances that an organization typically creates and distributes as its standards. If your organization has done this, a unique Appearance Gallery may be loaded automatically when you launch Creo Parametric. To load custom Appearance Galleries, open the Appearance Gallery and select Appearances Manager from the palette. In the Appearances Manager dialog box, click File, Open, and then browse and double-click the appearance file that you want to open. Click Override All to overwrite any appearances with the same name as those in the appearance file you just opened. Appearance-related tasks within Creo Parametric are typically limited to creating and editing appearances, applying and clearing appearances, and managing appearances. The next task is to apply an appearance to these two components of the assembly. Press Ctrl to select them both. After selecting the components, open the Appearance Gallery and in the Library Palette you can select various groups of appearances. For these models, you'll activate the Standard Metals group and select the appearance named PTC Standard Aluminum Polished. As soon as this is done, that appearance is automatically applied to the two selected components. You can also copy and then edit existing appearances. Open the Appearance Gallery and in the Model Palette, right-click PTC Standard Aluminum Polished and select New from the pop-up menu. In the Appearance Editor dialog box, edit the name to be transparent aluminum, and then slide the transparency control to approximately 70%. After completing the new appearance definition, it can be applied to components of the assembly by selecting them. Open the chuck part, and then create another new appearance that will be applied to it. In part mode, the appearance gallery is found in the view tab. Open the appearance gallery, and in the my appearances palette, Right-click the appearance named Ref Color 1 and select New. Name the appearance My Color 1, and then click the color rectangle to edit its color to be 127 for red, 137 for green, and 145 for blue. Now if the part is selected, the appearance will be applied only to the selected surface. The appearance can be applied to the entire part by selecting the part name in the model tree or in the graphics area using Query to select the entire part. The Control key can be used to apply appearances to multiple selected surfaces of the model. After selecting black from the My Appearances palette, press Control and select more than one surface. Creo Parametric enables you to easily apply, edit, and manage appearances that are applied to your design models.